I do not even know you. You're asking me for my phone number. People on the internet are very presumptuous. I'll tell you that. Hi, y'all. So, today's my last day off for this week. It's been a long time since I've gotten two days off. Well, last week I did. So that was kind of nice. But um, last night I went to the gym. We went to the gym and it was kind of horrifying. I feel like it's because it's the first in a very long time that I've been. So it was a painful experience to say the least. Okay, but I got up this morning and I figured it makes sense to just do an app workout. So I'm gonna try and do that. This 12 to 30, I'm gonna try and do it three times a week. Oh my gosh, I'm just saying that right now. I'm gonna try and do it three times a week, as many times a week as I can to see how that works out. And then maybe after I come home from doing it, I'll feel like doing a little at-home workout too. I don't know. Because I'm literally only going to go three times a week when this young man is going. So there's that. I feel like last night I definitely needed the motivation and that was pretty good. I Today I want to dye my hair black and put on this U-part wig that I bought. But I feel like I definitely need to do the workout before I do anything else because I feel like doing it right now but I'm not sure how long I'm going to feel like doing it for. I feel very accomplished because I feel like well, I did my first developmental psychology class last night. That was pretty good. It was very interesting. I feel like this um, professor, this tutor is way better than um, the man that I had for sociology. I like how she tutors better. So there's that. Hopefully I can get her for another class. I don't know. I actually need to, let me make a to-do list right now. Because right now I'm looking at the baseboards and stuff and they could take a good wipe down. So. We're going to add that to the to-do list for today. To do. So we're going to start with wipe. Mm -mm. So wig clips into halfway. One, two, wipe down baseboards. Two could be putting the hair dye in my hair and then wiping down the baseboard. Then wipe down the baseboard. So by the time I'm done wiping down the baseboards, it's time to like wash out the hair dye and shower. Yeah, that sounds great. Um, well, I'm definitely gonna work out. That's that's the first thing on the list here. And it's gonna be very oddly satisfying to go through and like check these off. So I'm gonna work out, sew the wig clips inside of the little wig that I made. Hopefully I like the wig because that's my issue these days. And like it's, <laughs> it's getting cooler. So what else do I wanna do today? I already cleaned the microwave. Maybe get my nails done, maybe. Do I feel like spending that money today? Absolutely not, so it's a strong maybe maybe get nails done and then here's my thing too right i can already tell that i need to get my toes done and uh, i'm not gonna go there and just do my nails and not do my toes and i also want to take these nails off because not only do they grow out significantly they absolutely you guys can't see them from there y'all probably can't see them they grew out significantly but my nails have also grown all the way up underneath them. And typically when my nails grow up underneath them like that, I like to take them off because my nails start lifting like along the sides and stuff underneath it, which means it doesn't last that long. What is your phone number? Whose son is this? Bro, are you dead ass? I do not even know you. You're asking me for my phone number. People on the internet are very presumptuous. I'll tell you that. Oh my God. And I'm looking at old pictures to see if this is somebody that I know. Absolutely not. So we're going to pass on the phone number. Anyways, yeah, what else do I have to do? Maybe I'll make something to eat today. You know what? I'll absolutely do that. Make some, what am I going to call that? Seasoned rice. Put some shrimp in there. Yeah, I'm going to take the shrimp out. Yesterday, I took some shrimp out to cook and that didn't really go anywhere because I forgot because I had my class yesterday. So let's do that right now while I remember. The kitchen is right there. You all will see me. So we're going to do some shrimp, but I love these ones because they're very small. So shrimp, I'm going to make some rice, mixed vegetable, where's that? mixed vegetable I'll let that frost nicely i'm definitely going to use some raisins because the last time that i did this i used raisins and i really loved it i need some eggs but that i can take out when i'm actually ready and for the most part i think that's it so i need to find the workout that i'm actually going to do i'm looking i also just took some pictures of myself because apparently I've, I've started working out again so I took some pictures of myself and weighed myself which I'm 157 a few weeks ago I was 154 so that's something that we need to address ASAP because like where are we going we're not going back up to 160 but here's the thing that is comfortable weight and I always notice that so we're gonna work on that and by doing the 12 to 30 for at least a month three times a week I should be seeing some amount of results okay so I want to stay consistent with that are we gonna go to the gym today? Yeah, I think we, we agreed to go into the gym today. 
So I need to do a lot of things around here first so that we can actually go to the gym. So that's great. So far I have two, four, six things on my to-do list. Let's get through that and see what else we can get done. Okay. Okay. Because if I try this, when I'm done, if I try this wig on and I, and I like how it looks, then I'm going to braid my hair down to wear the wig. So we need to see that too. But um, yeah, we're going to, we're going to do this. All right, guys, I used all three bundles. Hold on. Just like literally all of the three, because, you know, typically when you're doing a sewing, you would use the three bundles. But, you know, because I was doing just a portion of my hair and I was leaving the perimeter out, then there was only so much that I could fit on there. However, because it's a whole, no, the whole thing is on there. What do you mean? No. But even if I do, I sew the, the no, well, not exactly, no. But the time is getting cold, so, you know, it kind of works. And even if I wanted to, like, twist it on the side, I could still do that the way how I'm doing it right now. All right, guys, so I'm talking to my sister. I've managed to knock a few things off of my to-do list. I knocked working out off. I was going to do a screen recording and put it on here so you guys can see it, but that's too much work, honestly, and I'm, like, I'm on FaceTime with my sister. She's on the screen. It's too much. So I worked out. Um, I sew the wig clips in. This is the U-part wig. I know. My hair in it is literally the same length, but it, like we don't have to talk about it. Like we don't, it's not necessary. All right. I have the hair dye out here on the, on the kitchen table. It's already mixed and everything. So I literally just need to take this off of my, off of my hair, which I could do and put the hair dye inside of my hair. Right? So since I already have it mixed, maybe I could mark it as done. So we're going to mark it as done, you know, just so we seem productive or whatever. And then when I put it in my hair, I'm going to wipe the baseboards down. Can I find everything to do that? Absolutely. As I'm talking about putting the hair dye in my hair, let me take my watch off because honest to God, the last time I had dye on the screen protector thing that I had on the screen because I was being careless, all right? But this is how, this is how the wig looks. You see, it comes all the way up to the side. So if I wanted to leave like a little bit of hair out on the sides here, I could definitely do that so I could like pull it back or whatever. Am I gonna do that? I don't know yet. Maybe not because I really want this to be low maintenance. Could I do that and still be fine? Absolutely. So we don't know yet is what I'm getting at. So I'm going to take this off and ow, ow, ow. Okay. And for security, <laughs> wow, I look like a crackhead. Okay. This is on a mesh cap. So if I hold it up, y'all probably can see me through it. Not really, I'm exaggerating, but you know, you get it. But, um... I could go back in and dye this if I wanted to, but it's pretty black right now, so it's completely fine. Currently, I have six clips in there. I have one at the part here. I have one on the front here. Another one on the front here. Two on the sides, so that it's, like, secured. And then I have one on the back, because, you know, it needs to be on there. I could go ahead and, like, sew um, two more in up along, like, the front here. So like right here, I don't know if I'm going to do that. Honestly, I'm discombobulated and I literally have a lot of things that I need to get done, especially running through this to-do list. So maybe I'll do it later. Maybe not. I don't really know. Am I going to wash my hair and just slick it back in a bun because I cannot be bothered? Maybe. Let me look at the weather really quickly to see how many more cool days we have or like how many more hot days we have before it officially gets cold. Oh. Not that many. Today's Thursday. Friday isn't going to be too bad. Okay, so it's saying that the high for the next 10 days is, is in the 70s. So I think I'm going to be fine if I wear a bun for like the next week. And then I could officially start like rolling that out. But like this is good. This is great actually. So I'm going to dye my hair and wash it. And I know this shit is going to be bleeding all over the place. Because typically when I dye my hair it bleeds a lot. Especially with this new dye. And, um, so dye my hair, wipe down the baseboards while the dye is in my hair. And then I have a video to edit, maybe do my nails and make some seasoned rice. So I just have like a few things left on the to-do list. I also think I agreed to something. I can't remember what it is. So let me just find out real quick. I'm supposed to be picking up, well, I'm not supposed to be picking up. And I think it should already be picked up. Um, laundry today and I heard that a surprise is in the works for me. Do I know what that is? Absolutely not. Am I excited? I'm anxious. I feel like I shouldn't have known that one was in the works, you know? I would have preferred to just be surprised, but we're not complaining here. A surprise is a, pri a surprise is a surprise. So there's that and then um 
did I agree to going back to the gym today? I don't know. But I, 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 I completed like a little workout, even though honestly, I was stressed out. Like my legs literally gave out on me. And I think that has a lot to do with the workout that I did last night that was mainly focused on my legs. So like I should have known better. What I was attempting to do was an ab workout. I literally lasted six minutes. So like we're not even, we're not even going to talk about that because what in the actual... But um, yeah, I'm gonna knock these few things out of the way. Hopefully I don't get hair dye all over my face and my skin. At least not the parts that are visible. Because I still, uh, yeah, at least not the parts that are visible. Oh, I could put this towel over me. But I have my hair um, in two right now. Let me just take it out. You guys, here's the dilemma with the, with the, with the half wig literally being, the U part wig literally being the same length as my hair, right? I think I, I didn't realize that my hair was uh, that much, you know, because I clipped some off a few months ago. I had my friend clip some off for me, like earlier this year, and, you know, I didn't expect it to grow back as quickly, and I literally have not straightened it yet, so I, you know, I just don't know. And so I bought 18 inches. I was also trying to be cheap because it was already $100, and I'm like, man, I'm not spending that much money on this hair because, one, I don't know what the quality of this hair is like, and two... I don't even know if I'm going to um, keep it in for long because the way how my shit is set up, I like something for 45 seconds and then after that I'm so over it. Like I, <laughs> I park it and that's it. But this texture literally is the same texture as my hair. So I like it more because I bought a, a U-part wig before and it didn't even, the curls were, were long and wavy. They weren't, they weren't um, kinky. So, my sister hung up on me, so that didn't work out for me. And so, like, with this one so far, it I wore it and it literally looks my, like my hair. And I have a video up. Um, maybe I'll link the video on the screen if I remember. If not, I will just um, put a picture on the screen so you guys can see what it looks like. But I'm braiding my hair in two. So, it's easy to apply the hair dye without getting it literally all over the place. Like, as I'm looking at my hair right now... Is this not literally where the twists were just now? But um, yeah, that's the plan for today because I put this, I bleached my hair a couple of weeks ago and I literally just hate it. So like we're, we're fixing that right now. I need to get this living room together because for the last week I've been making this U-part wig. Because honestly, these days it takes me so much longer to do these things that are related to hair. Seven minutes of talking. Anyways, I'm going to knock out the rest of the things that I have to do and I will pop back in later if i get a surprise and if not i'll still pop back in i did indeed get a surprise these beautiful roses the ferrero rocher that you guys can see in the background and the hirachis on the floor because i saw him in a pair and i told him that i loved it so much and he decided to buy me a pair so that was pretty nice